I'm so happy to be here because the fact that we're able to sit with people from China, from India and, and Spain talking about how film is shot and produced and distributed in their regions, I think will definitely help with other countries, emerging markets like Nigeria, that are trying to emulate places that we probably don't understand the market and what, what led to them doing business the way they do. And let's learn from them and get Nigeria better, Nigerian movies better. If we look at Bollywood or Hollywood films, you'll find that sometimes the marketing budget they have for the PR angle, for example, is always very significant. By and large, Nigerian movies focus more on how much money they want to spend on shooting the film. A lot of the times they focus more on the money for the technical side, the equipment. And then they don't pay that much attention to things like, okay, which actors are we putting in it? Sometimes they put actors in it that are just known because they're maybe legends in the game, but they might necessarily be perfect for the role and then they don't publicize it well enough. And so I'll give you an example. There's a movie called 50, which they did a lot of publicity for. And so much so it meant that when Netflix came around to wanting to buy rights to put it on Netflix, they actually paid them more than they paid any other Nigerian movie on that platform so far. PR. A lot of people will tell you that piracy is a huge issue in Nigeria, and it is. But I'll take that back and say that for me, I think that it's more about the story that we're telling. The stories we're telling, why we're telling it, and who we're telling it for. Once we can figure that out and sort it out, we'll do a lot better with us Nigerian films.